you know, unless you just started shooting 120 film or you maybe have been getting lab scans of your 120 film and so it all comes to you uncut and then you keep it uncut in full rolls, most of us probably have pre-cut film, you know, strips of three or four or five. Um, I use standard print file uh, negative holders, negative uh, sleeves that hold, that are, you know, uh, eight and a half by 11, fit in a regular binder. Um, so for Pentex for six, seven, I get uh, strips of three and then a strip of two. Um, so I have a lot that are strips of two. And so here's the problem that I have run into. Um, let's say you are, turn this light back on. All right. You are scanning your one frame. And even if I bring it all the way to the left edge, um, where that mask is right there, and I capture this, and it hasn't engaged the roller yet because the rollers are over here on the left. Um, so I just have to push it. I'm gonna open the gate like they suggest you do. And I'm gonna push it, and now that's as far as I can push from over here on the right. There's no more film sticking out. It's not engaged the roller yet. So now my film is trapped. So I have to open this, and I've noticed you know, my setup so far, the lens is low enough that I can't even open this all the way. And I have to just slide that across. And I give it some, there we go. And then it engages, and then I can capture the next frame. Um, and then I can slide that out. Now, the 35 millimeter Mark I carrier, a lot of people talk about cut frames. And I've scanned even down to a single frame, so I can slide this strip, that's two frames. So I can slide it into there, capture it, and then I can push in, and there's my finger, because this opening is big enough to put my finger in. Slide it through, capture, and then I can bring my finger up top here till the roller engages, and then I can remove my film. You can't do that with the 120 carrier. So again, if I have my film here, I can get that in. can't push it any farther. This thing is too big. Um, I have not tried to take it apart yet to see if that piece is removable, if it's part of the whole interior assembly. I'm assuming it is. Um, and so this part is a little annoying that I have to kind of slide it along. Um, 